Hello everybody. A couple of days ago I bought this new drone. It's the DJI Mini 2. It's the latest small form factor drone and it creates awesome 4K footage. Really crisp and has excellent flight range. Last Friday I tested it and it was about 3 kilometers in rural area. So yeah, that's really great uh, for a form factor like this. This is the controller. Here you can put your phone to control uh, the camera footage. And it feels uh, sturdy and um, yeah, it's a great controller. I bought the, uh, the kit with the extra batteries in there. And each battery has it about uh, 30 minutes flight time. It depends on the temperature and the flight conditions of course. So I thought to do something else and I also ordered the um, Alien Tech range controller. The official name is the Alien Tech Duo 2 2.4 5.8 gig dual band signal booster and it's a range extender for DJI drones and um, this one is the, um, the active extender with the batteries in there so you power it up to get more range and um, uh, so it's it should have more range than the uh, passive extender just the antennas here I power it up the website says it has at, you should get at about um, two times the range you get with the standard controller so that's really nice and I'm very curious how that uh, that goes this bracket here is not included with the range extender itself so you should order it if you want this kit and you want to put it onto your controller um, so you should have a look at that this bracket actually is for the Mavic Air um, but I think that the Mavic Air 2 and the Mini 2 controllers are alike they're the same <laughs> or actually I hope so so the range extender connects to these coaxial cables and the coaxial cables they go inside your controller so I will be opening up the controller to install the kit and then these plugs they go into your range extender and this bracket it goes up onto your controller just like this uh, oh, I think it's the other way around sorry right here and then this second part of the bracket uh, it goes underneath here And then here you put the screws and I think I'll put some glue underneath it. So I think it feels quite sturdy so I think that's good. And then the antennas go through these uh, holes and then you connect the range extender onto it. Uh, not under it, onto it. Yeah, It fits on fit right here and then the connectors they are swivelable so um, so you can point the antenna at where you need the range to be extended so I'm really curious about what it does and about the performance the only thing I need to figure out is how to put the USB cable in there because I think it's, uh, it's, it's connected a bit strange with the bracket in there but I think I'll uh, figure it out it's no big deal I think you have to turn it around to get it uh, fixed in the right direction and um, yeah that's about it I'm very curious about the performance I hope it does what it, what it advertises on the website and I will be installing it soon and uh, keep you up to date 
Thanks for watching and take care.